See, this is the error message I get. We could not create a new partition. This is some kinds of error code. Click on OK. And Windows cannot install on this drive. When you click on Show Details, Windows cannot install on this disk. The disk, selected disk is of GPT partition style. So how do you fix this issue? Okay guys, this happens uh, when your pen drive you have created a bootable pen drive using MRV partition and your hard disk is with uh, GPT partition. You can see currently the hard disk is with GPT partition style and my pen drive when I just uh, created a bootable pen drive I choose it as MRB. So it happens with the UEFI mode or the legacy mode. So your pen drive, uh, your hard disk is of uh, UEFI partition uh, mode and your pen drive is of a legacy mode. So this happens. Uh, so how do you change it? Either you have to uh, change your pen drive. You have to get the pen drive one that is uh, one that has used it. Uh, it's uh, one that has been created for UEFI uh, or GPT. So if you want to change the pen drive, you have to reboot your pen drive. You have to create a bootable pen drive once again using a GPT partition or UEFI. Or either if you don't want to create a, another bootable pen drive, you can change from here also. So how do you change from here? Just click on OK. You have to delete all these partitions. You have to delete this partition, this partition, this partition, and this partition, all these partitions. So before you go with the deletion, uh, there's one more method you can see. Okay guys, you hold the shift key and press F10 key. This will open the command prompt. So hold the shift key in your keyboard and then press F10 key in your keyboard holding the shift key. So you have to press the shift key and F10 key together and this opens the command prompt. Now we'll go it inside Dix part. So type it D I S K P R T. Press enter key. Now, once you type the disk part, you have to click on list disks. You can show the list of disks. Now you can recognize the disks with the size. Disk 0 is 119 GB. So my 119 GB is hard disk, I know that. And disk 1 is 7 GB. It's, uh, that means it's 7728 MB. That is equal to 7 GB. That is my pen drive. I can recognize that. I know that. Now, my hard disk was in GPT. My pen drive is in MRB. That is why it was not installing. So what I gonna do now? Now I gonna convert this uh, hard disk from GP to GPT to MRB. So how am I gonna do that? So at first you have to select this. Select disk. So my hard disk is disk zero. Now disk zero is selected disk. Now I gonna clean it. Clean, press enter key. Done. I'm done that. Now I'm gonna type C O N B E R T convert M R B C O N B E R T convert space M R B. Now my disk will be converted to M R B. It was GPT. Now it will be converted to M R B. Press enter key. Now I'm gonna exit. You can exit once again. And now you're gonna go with the custom install. Now you can see all the dicks has been deleted and currently I have only one disk and I do not have any kinds of error message over here. Like uh, your particular uh, windows will not be installed in this. I was getting the error message, now no error message. Click on next. So I'll create one hard disk of around 100 GB. So it is since it is in EMB, so 100 into 1024. It's uh, 1024. Okay, it's uh, 1024, and put two more zero. Click on apply. Click on OK. Now you can see created. The system reserve 
and this is a dix2 of 99 gb and this is another of 99 gb i can create another one apply so i have a two different partition i've created a two different partition now i can install you can see no error message i can install in any drive two two drive three no error message i can install some windows software in any drive the another way is uh, if you get the error message like this what you're gonna do just delete all the partition just delete all the partition this is a is another easy way if this do not work you can go with the command prompt method you can see windows cannot be installed in this just delete these partitions delete all the partitions so if you get the error message like this you're gonna delete all the partition and create one single partition so if this method do not work you're gonna try command prompt method if command prompt method do not work you're gonna try this one so I hope one either method either method will help you click on new and now I'm gonna create another partition uh, 1024.00 this will be around 100 GB create one partition of 19 GB and I'll just install operating system over here click on next and now you can see guys it is installing the easy way you can convert from GPT to MRP MRP to GPT and you can install the software if you have, if you get the error message like this if you get the error message as MRP error you convert your hard disk to GPT if you're getting the error message as a GPT, you convert the GPT to MRP. So your pen drive and hard disk should be either in, in it should be in a single mode. Either it need, needs to be in a legacy mode or UEFI mode. It needs both needs to be either GPT or MRP. So give some time and it will install.